What is colon therapy? Top 10 most commonly asked colonic questions Colon therapy is the safe, gentle use of warm filtered water introduced into the colon to hydrate, stimulate and evacuate waste from the body. It is a wonderful adjunct therapy to assist with achieving optimal health. This article is a helpful tool for individuals wanting to learn truthful information about colon therapy. 1. What is holistic health? Holistic health is an approach to healing by treating the whole body versus one particular part. The holistic treatment is designed to complement the entire body unit and to achieve optimal health. 2. What is colon therapy? Colon therapy, also known as colon hydrotherapy or colonic irrigation, is an internal bath which removes waste from the body by introducing warm, filtered water into the colon. The filtered water will soften and loosen fecal material, resulting in waste evacuation through the natural peristalsis of the colon. 3. What are the benefits of having a colon therapy session? Colon hydrotherapy is a gentle washing of the colon. The experience of a colonic will have three positive effects. The warm, filtered water will hydrate the colon resulting in a moistening of hard fecal material stagnant in the colon. This hydration will help the colon muscles activate resulting in the stimulation of peristalsis muscle movement in the colon. The combination of hydration and stimulation of peristalsis improves the evacuation of fecal material stuck inside the colon. 4. Is having a colon therapy session sanitary? Yes. At my practice, Lifetime Health and Consulting, LLC, the colonic is performed with a Clearwater, FDA registered, PPC 101 The Traveler, US Patent No. 5,871,463 colon therapy device. The instrument is designed for use in a variety of situations to include hospitals, nursing homes, clinics, and more. The instrument is a closed system that avoids offensive odors and leakage. It employs a disposable, single-use, two-tube speculum, an adjustable, temperature-controlled shut-off valve, and a water pressure regulator, relief system. Furthermore, the unit is sterilized after each session with an EPA-approved and hospital-grade caviside solution. Lastly, the Traveler connections are in compliance with City Water and Sewage Commission standards to prevent backflow issues. 5. What will happen during a colon therapy session? A colonic session is like taking a warm, relaxing, internal whirlpool bath. It is a comfortable experience for most people. At the onset of the session you will disrobe from the waist down. Depending on your colon therapy office, a gown, towel or sheet is worn to ensure modesty. After reclining on a padded table, you will experience the gentle, self-insertion of a speculum into the rectum. A small amount of temperature-controlled and pressure-regulated, filtered water enters the colon via the inflow tube while the instrument gauge monitors the pressure inside the colon. The water softens and loosens fecal material which stimulates the colon's natural peristaltic action to release waste. Upon release, fecal matter is expelled through the observation tube via the outflow tube. This process is repeated several times within a 45 to 50 minute session. 6. How long is the colon therapy session? The typical initial visit is a 90-minute session to include a 0.5-hour consultation. At completion of the consultation, the client will spend 45 to 50 minutes on the colon therapy table undergoing the colonic session. The remaining 10 to 15 minutes is spent talking about your session and how you would like to move forward. Subsequently, follow-up visits are typically 60 minutes from start to completion. 7. How many colon therapy sessions do I need? The number of colon therapy sessions desired is discussed between the client and practitioner. Ultimately, the client has final say. This number is influenced by the individual's personal colon health goals. For example, think of a colonic as an exercise regimen. Your goal may include weight loss and muscle training prompting you to exercise one time per week until desired results are achieved. Another person's goal may only include maintenance prompting exercise only one time per month on a continual basis. Colon therapy can complement any regimen or program. 8. Why should I take interest in this procedure? My body is working just fine. To answer this question, I will compare your body to your house. 
Your body represents your house. Your house has a trash receptacle in the form of a trash can. The trash can should be emptied regularly or your house will stink. Additionally, the can should receive a periodic washing to remove waste which may have accumulated at the bottom or around the inside circumference of the can. Your body should receive the same consideration. Your body has a trash receptacle in the form of a colon. The colon should be emptied regularly, preferably consistent with your daily meal regimen, or your body will stink. This odor could come from bad breath, unexplainable body odor or a pungent smelling sweat. If you feel like your body's colon is working just fine, remember the earlier example of your house trash can, consider a periodic maintenance cleanse to release any debris which may have accumulated around the circumference of the colon walls, over the years, so you can support the continuance of optimal health. 9. Is a colonic the same as a colonoscopy? A colonic and a colonoscopy are two very different procedures. A colonoscopy is a visual examination of the colon utilizing a colonoscope. This procedure is helpful in identifying any pre-cancerous situations or other unusual behavior within the colon. A colonic is an internal cleansing of the colon utilizing warm, filtered water. Many clients use a colonic as a preparation for a colonoscopy procedure. 10. What is the difference between a colonic and an enema? There are several differences between the two. A colonic can ultimately cleanse the entire length of the colon, while an enema cleanses the lower part of the colon sigmoid, and a portion of the descending colon. Colonics provide multiple infusions of water into the colon, where enemas provide a gravity flow of one or two water infusions into the colon. With a colonic, the fecal material leaves the body through a tube while the client continues to relax. During an enema, the client must reposition onto the toilet to release fecal material. During a colonic, clients can see the fecal material through a view tube as it is passing. This viewing is not possible with an enema. As the fecal material passes through a tube, odor is eliminated during a colonic. With enemas, the smell is present for all passing fecal material. I trust this information is very helpful to you. There are many additional questions people have about utilizing colon therapy. It is an excellent adjunct therapy for assistant with healing the body. For additional education about the colon therapy process, visit www.colonictruths.com and opt into the email list to view a series of free colon therapy education videos and voice recorded client interviews. Upon opening your confirmation email you will receive an awesome video education to help you make an informed decision about colon therapy use. Enjoy! Joya Z. Baines is a certified colon therapist known as Sage Joya to her many clients. A sage is one whom shares wisdom and sound judgment to individuals seeking guidance, as one reconnects with self, along their personal journey. Sage Joya believes we are all a mirror reflection of one another position to help people as we serve our life's purpose. Colon hydrotherapy can prepare to colonoscopy you are waiting for gastroenterologist will perform colonoscopy for you. The purpose of the preparation colonoscopy is removing all fecal matter stool from the colon. It helps the gastroenterologist to perform the colonoscopy, doctor needs a clear view of the intestinal wall. To see what is inside your colon, your large intestine has to be empty and clean. There are two choices. One is harsh laxatives at home another is colon hydrotherapy in the office. The laxatives need a prescription drugs from the doctor. It can need a gallon pitcher with a powder inside. The patient will fill the pitcher with water and drink one glass of the mixture 10 minutes apart until the entire gallon is finished. After the first few glasses, diarrhea will begin. Other OTC medications cause diarrhea by using an enema at home or faking 40 tablet of the sodium phosphate. Some home enema products can create kidney damage, therefore, in December of 2008, FDA required to carry a black box warning regarding the risk of kidney damage. Panel of Doctors from Society of American Gastrointestinal and Endoscopic Surgeons, and American Society for Gastrointestinal Endoscopy published the guidelines on bowel preparation before colonoscopy. The medical doctors agreed, caution should be taken in selecting a bowel preparation for patients with significant hepatic, renal, or cardiac dysfunction, and for those at the extremes of age. 
For young, healthy people preparatory measures to colonoscopy at home cannot cause any problem. What for people with kidney, heart, liver, diseases, overweight issues, hemorrhoids, chronic constipation, persons, who are definitely old and weak. Having frequent diarrhea, nausea, vomiting, and abdominal cramps can exacerbate health conditions, which can lead to stop the medication and make cleansing of the large intestine not thorough. In turn, this makes it difficult for the doctor to examine the entire colon. Fortunately, people can use another smart way of cleansing the colon to prepare it for colonoscopy. It is colon hydrotherapy, aka colonic. Clean colon with water has been known since the 14th century BC enema was regular medical treatment in the 19th and 20th centuries and medical doctors prescribed them for many health conditions. Currently there are updated, FDA-registered, colon hydrotherapy machines with thermostat, manometer, disposable equipment. We have hundreds well-trained colon hydrotherapists in the US, which can cleanse colon by using irrigation with purify and clear water and soft abdominal massage. A number of American medical doctors endorse colon hydrotherapy as safe and effective way of preparation of the large intestine for colonoscopy. A well-known gastrointestinal surgeon Leonard Smith, MD, of Gainesville, Florida says. I am very well acquainted with the colon's functions, and my true belief is that colon hydrotherapy is the perfect cleansing medium for preparing the patient for colonoscopy. Douglas Brody, MD, of Reno, Nevada believes. Colon hydrotherapy is the best cleansing and detoxifier for the gastrointestinal tract that anybody would want. I do promote its use. Board-certified gastroenterologist, Robert Charm, MD, of Walnut Creek, California, a clinical professor of medicine at the University of California recommends. And by all means, I prefer my patients undergo colon hydrotherapy the morning of a colonoscopy. It's a safe way to cleanse the gut. It's a healing technique for the relief of irritable bowel syndrome with gas and bloating, chronic constipation, abdominal discomfort, and many other GI tract problems. Colon hydrotherapy is the healthiest known way to cleanse the large intestine prior to a colonoscopy and is currently being used in hospitals, for example, Danbury Connecticut Hospital has made it the perfect choice for preparation. The advantages of the preparing to colonoscopy by using colon hydrotherapy, aka colonic, are 1. Cleansing colon does not involve drinking a gallon of water or taking strong laxatives. 2. Procedure accomplishes in arranged office restful lying down position with continuing supervision by a well-trained colon hydrotherapist. Small disposable tube will be gently inserted in the rectum. Colon will be flushed out with warm, clear, purified water. Pressure inside the colon is typically low, even less than tension in the bathroom by releasing the stool during constipation. 3. When the person feels the urgency to defecate, the flow of water will be ended, and discharge valve is opened to allow the colon to naturally clear itself of waste that is carried out by the outflow of water. 4. Repeat water flashing can release the fecal matter from entire colon even in case of the chronic constipation. By medical literature, the colon hydrotherapy in 98% cases aided gastroenterologists to observe the clear view of the entire colon lumen. It helps to secure and productively view the colon. 5. Experienced colon hydrotherapist provides the gentle abdominal massage. It drives the water deeper until it reaches the cecum, beginning of the colon. Massage also helps to lessen the waste from the colon wall and to support peristaltic action of the colon. All colon cleansing practices may wash out not only waste but also various minerals and friendly beneficial intestinal flora. To prepare a person to colonoscopy Europeans use healing mineral water prepared from genuine Carlevy Vary Thermal Spring Salt. European doctors have recommended drinking this water in the nearly all colon disorders for 250 years. Carlevy Vary Healing Mineral Water boosts and enhances the outcomes of a colon hydrotherapy session by eliminating spasms, cramps and making it more pleasant and successful. Frequently the client and the colon hydrotherapist are surprised at the bulky release during this session. Carlevy Vary Healing Mineral Water may supply the body with essential minerals and trace elements. In my clinic, we use high-quality complete probiotics to restore the beneficial intestinal bacteria in the colon. 
we advise taking them after colonoscopy one month. For the colon preparing and a clear view of colon lumen, it is suggested to get colon hydrotherapy session one or two days before to exam and in the morning prior to colonoscopy. Time to complete the colon hydrotherapy sessions is between 30 to 40 minutes. There is no specific instructions for colon hydrotherapy are needed, just do not eat solid foods two hours prior to the procedure. A safe and valuable way to prepare large intestine for colonoscopy is the colon hydrotherapy. It is especially useful for the elderly, sick and constipated. Colon hydrotherapy is also helpful for diabetics, patients with liver, kidney, heart problems, overweight issue, persons unable to tolerate fasting, and those who are incapable to bear frequent diarrhea. The choice is yours. The information contained here is presented for educational, informational purposes only. It is not intended to diagnose, treat, cure, or prevent any disease. This information is not to be used to replace the services or instructions of a physician or qualified healthcare practitioner. Peter Melaind, PhD received his medical education first as a registered nurse and then as a medical doctor in Russia. He took specialized training in anesthesiology, intensive care, and internal medicine. Working as a physician, he became interested in holistic healing through his clinical experience with herbs, acupuncture, healing mineral water, and internal cleansing. He was granted a license to practice acupuncture in Russia in 1978, and from that time, he combined conventional Western medical treatment with herbs, acupuncture, and other non-drug healing therapies. In 1975, Peter Melamed established biotherapy as a natural, holistic approach to healing. Biotherapy combines the wisdom of traditional Russian folk medicine, ancient oriental medical therapies, and European naturopathy with cutting-edge Western technology. After immigrating to the USA and passing all the exams, Peter Melaine succeeded in starting up a private practice in 1996 at the Biotherapy Alternative Medicine Clinic of San Francisco Bay Area.